the first NFL Sunday of the 2020 season, but it was a pair of baseball feats that stole the headlines. Up the Got middle! Baez has it! It's a no-hitter! The former college walk-on has made history in Milwaukee! WGN on the call, Cubs pitcher Alec Mills tossing the second no-hitter of the season as Chicago blanked Milwaukee 12-0. Mills, who was a walk-on at the University of Tennessee at Martin, struck out five and walked three on 114 pitches. His 5Ks are the fewest in an ono since Dallas Braden's perfect game in 2010. Meanwhile, over in Denver, Albert Pujols celebrated a milestone blast. Albert Sky went down the left field line, hit well. He's watching this one go. That is gone. Big fly number 660 for Albert Pujols. He is just now tied Willie Mays on the all-time home run list. Audio from the Angels' Twitter. With that long ball, Pujols moves into a tie for fifth all-time with home runs with 660 with Willie Mays. The Angels went on to win the game 5-3 over the Rockies. As for the NFL, it was not the start Tom Brady imagined with Tampa Bay. The Bucks falling to the Saints 34-23. Brady went 23 of 36 for 239 yards and tossed two TDs, but also two interceptions. Anytime you turn the ball over like we did, um, you know, we had opportunities out there to make plays and, and uh, it just came up short. So um, there's no excuses. and We're the only ones that could do something about it. Uh, the Saints kind of play how they always play. Uh, you know, they, they did a good job on offense. You know, we hung our defense out to dry, you know, on some short fields. Audio from the Bucks Twitter. As for his counterpart, Drew Brees registered 160 yards on 18 of 30 with two touchdowns. Over in the NBA, let's play a game seven. The Nuggets defeated the Clippers 111-98 to even their second round series at three. Denver trailed Los Angeles by 19 points with 22 minutes remaining. Nikola Jokic amassed 34 points and 14 rebounds and Jamal Murray tallied 21 points. Paul George led the way for the Clippers with 33 points. The Nuggets are now 5-0 this postseason when facing elimination as they came back from a 3-1 deficit in their first round series against the Jazz. With your sports wrap-up, I'm Ann Sachs.